Just like professional athletes wouldn't step onto the field without practicing during the offseason, world-class sled dogs don't hit the trail without months of intense training. In order to complete a thousand mile race, a sled dog team has to be in peak physical condition. To train a team at that level with the way the race has gotten today, being an eight to nine day race, you've got to have the consistency of training. You've got to be able to get out there and get longer runs in more consistently. Training for us is a year round thing. So we start ATV training in September and we usually start short runs, four or five, six mile runs, and then just slowly build. Um, when we get to January, we're doing 250, 300 mile series. You just have to go out and do it. But making sure the dogs are in good shape is only one aspect of training. Mushers also have to prepare their dogs for the rigors of the trail. Wind, rain, snow, and ice, these dogs have to be ready for anything the trail throws their way. We train in a place called Eureka that's up by Manly Hot Springs. And there's real harsh conditions up there, real rough trails. There's a couple mountain summits. We have real high winds um, like all the time. If the wind's blowing 40 miles an hour and you don't want to go out, well then it's time to go out because that's what's going to happen when we hit the coast on a dead rod. And so we try to get the dogs out in those situations, get them to see that ahead of time and get us mentally prepared um, so that it's no big deal. We do this every day, who cares, let's go. Besides the physical conditioning, mushers also use training to build a bond with their dogs. One of the most important parts about training a dog team is ensuring that they listen to your commands. I mean, it's for their safety as well as yours. And so the lead dogs, we tell them G to go right and HA to go left. I think it comes from uh, horse driving. They always say like with a really good lead dog, you can like write your name in the snow. And so like with uh, Ruby, like my Ruby dog, you know, like having Ruby, it's like driving a car. I can go anywhere with her. 